Okay, guys. So we got two packages. We got one from Amazon and one from Entertainment Entertainment Earth. So I'm gonna open up this one and see what we got. I got two books. I got this. I got the Entertainment Earth thing a couple weeks ago. So anyway, guys, let's go ahead and take this one out and see what it is. So I got this, and I thought this was pretty cool because as some of y'all may know, I am, I do drawings too while I'm not like, while I'm bored. So check this out. It is the My Hero Academia, the official EC illustration guide. I'm going to look through every page, and this is like how to draw the characters like, Deku, All Might, Bakugo, Araka, um, Lemillion, and all that. But I'm gonna pause the video and read this off camera. So here we go. Okay, this book is going to get a hundred out of a hundred. But um, anyway, guys, um, I'm gonna do the other er, book review in the next video. So stay tuned for that. Hope you guys, hope you guys like, comment, subscribe. So the reason why I said I was going to review this book because I did get it out of this bag that the other book that y'all saw the last video uh, I unboxed plus reviewed out of this and ew, a little hair in my mouth. So here it is. It is the. Animal Crossing New Horizons Magna Volume 1. Here it is. Here's the front. And yes, this came out a year after New Horizons uh came out in 2020. So yep, um here's the front, the back, the Spine or whatever you call it. So yeah, um, glad I had this in my um video game collection. But I'm going to read read it while the video is paused. So stay tuned. My favorite character is in this one. And that character is Isabel. Very cute. There's a Super Mario manga too. Well, let me rephrase that. Also, a Super Mario Magna. But, um, anyway, guys, this book is going to get a 100 out of a 100. Hope you guys like, comment, subscribe. Oh, wait a minute, hold on. I didn't even pop. I, I didn't even stop the video. Hope you guys like, comment, subscribe. Hope that will help because it's pretty hot out here. Okay, so big moment I've been waiting for. Yes, I bought this from Entertainment Earth. Cause I know I know like a lot I know this is actually the first time I made a video about Entertainment Earth. Need my lucky psychic. The box kata. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. I will show you guys what it is. And three, two, one. I thought I paused it. Hold on. Joink. Okay, so check this out. So, it is a Sega Ruby Rice plush. Um, yep. I found this on eBay, like, a few months ago. They wanted me to pay a hundred dollars for a plushie that recently just came out a few months ago. And I was like, you know what? I'm just gonna wait till Entertainment Earth gets done uh, making it a pre-order and that was it. But let's go ahead and take the tag off and see what she looks like without the tag on. So here we go. Okay guys, here she is without the tag on and the plush 
is going to get a hundred out of a hundred. Hope you guys like, comment, subscribe. Alrighty, guys. So, remember I said I am going to do a unwrapping video like I did uh, yesterday morning on the Goose Happy Meal toy? Well, this one's actually from Burger King. And I ordered this towards the end of October. And it was supposed to be delivered to me, like, last week, and it was uh, a nightmare. So, yep, let's go ahead and get this out of the box. So, y'all know this is not going to be an unboxing. Well, technically, it was in a box, so, yeah. But the title of the video, I'm just going, like, title old it, like, unwrapping. Just titled it unwrapping, so that's what I'm going to do. So, here we go. So, again, I forgot to tell you in the beginning of the video, this is actually going to be part of November's unboxing, like my final unboxing slash, well, mostly technically unwrapping, because, again, I'm putting this, and November's compilations, so let's get this out of the bag, and this is the Splatoon, to Splatoon 2 Burger King toy. So let's go ahead and get this out of the bag and see what it does. And three, two, one. Okay, guys. So here is the toy out of the bag. So pink, I want to say it's a reference to Cali. And green is a reference to um, Mari. So here's the gimmick it does. If I could do it. Hold on. Let's see if I can. Well, that's the gimmick, and this review and unwrapping is going to get a hundred out of a hundred. Hope you guys like, comment, subscribe.